How do propellers work? It's something of a mystery to a lot of folks, but here's a real easy way to think about it. Just imagine a screw turning through wood. It's the same thing, except the propellers turning through water, unless you hit something hard, in which case you end up with a propeller like this, which isn't going to do you much good. Now let's get a little bit more in depth. Propellers are measured by pitch and diameter. Pitch is the theoretical distance a propeller will move through the water in a perfect world. Diameter is, well, diameter. The next most important thing to know is how many blades a propeller should have. Now many sailboats that want to minimize drag, for example, they'll have two blade propellers like this one. Less blades, less drag. Most power boats do best with three bladed propellers and some in special cases some boats are going to have four or even five blade propellers. Materials are another important consideration. Smaller, less expensive propellers are usually made of aluminum. Larger props or more expensive props are generally made of stainless steel. And stainless steel does give you a performance advantage. On a lot of boats, it means you'll pick up two, three, maybe even four miles per hour. Larger boats that swing the propellers at slower RPM often have bronze or nibro propellers. Obviously, we're just scratching the surface here, folks. There's a lot more to learn about propellers. And if you go over to Boats.com and read some of our articles on propellers, you will learn a whole lot more. Hopefully, you'll also learn how to not do this.